Welcome to Faithful Families Podcast. I'm Terrence Andrews, the student pastor here at Westmead Baptist Church. Joined uh, with me a couple of my friends. Um, my name is Ben Tinley. I'm the children and family minister here at Westmead. And we're excited to get to finally uh, share with you an intro that will give you a little bit of background about our Faithful Sam Families podcast that we've been talking about. Um, one of the things that we're really excited about with that is the opportunity to have some special guests on with us each week. Um, some of them you'll know, some of them you won't. Um, today for the intro, as well as for our very first episode is none other than our pastor, Justin McAlpin. Hey, mm. Justin. Welcome. <laughs> Tell us Thanks a little bit uh, about why Faithful Families Matter, Justin. Uh, well, one of the things that I'm excited about for you guys in, in doing this and for our church family to do this is because all throughout Scripture, um, God calls us to be faithful as individual followers of Christ, as those who are marked by his people, mm -hmm. as we see in the Old Testament, and then those redeemed by Christ— he calls us to be faithful. And why are we called to be faithful? Because he is faithful. Yeah. Uh, and all throughout Scripture, he shows us and commands us and teaches us ways that we can be faithful in that. Uh, and particularly, he focuses on the family, all the way back from the Torah in the Old Testament, all the way into Paul's letters in the New Testament and everything in between. Uh, and even in Revelation, you see the, the value of the family and how that plays into it. And a passage of Scripture I'd like to read is from uh, Acts chapter 3, uh, beginning in verse 24. Uh, where the word of God says, beginning in verse 25, excuse me, it is you who are the sons of the prophets and of the covenant which God made with your fathers, saying to Abraham, and in your seed all the families of the earth shall be blessed. Mm -hmm. For you first, God raised up his servant and sent him to bless you by turning every one of you from your wicked ways. Amen. Those two verses, it really points to the calling of Christ because this is what we were redeemed for in Jesus to lead faithful families, to be faithful stewards of our families, not just as fathers or husbands, uh, but as followers of Christ. And, and you see that pattern all throughout from, from early on when God made the covenant from the Adamic covenant to the Noahic covenant to the Mosaic covenant and all throughout the covenant is all about you are my people and I want you, I will be your God. I want you to obey me, uh, that you belong to me and it would be reflected in how you live. Uh, and the people always struggled with that. And then Christ being the new covenant, uh, just what it says there, um, God raised us up even when we were sinners that Christ died for us and redeemed us so that we could be faithful. And in that, in every area of our lives, we practice being faithful to the Lord uh, in our families and in our marriages. Uh, and that's what I'm excited about this podcast is how it's going to push us forward and how to practically think through how God's Word is commanding us to live out the, the calling to be a faithful family. And yeah. if the family is faithful <clears throat> in the confines of their home, it will naturally spill over to benefit the church, that will benefit the church not just in our gatherings mm. uh, of the corporate body, but also will benefit the church in its missions to our schools, to our workplaces, uh, to our social settings, to everywhere we go, that it starts in the home. And then it just naturally is going to overflow and impact everything that those family members following Christ faithfully are a part of. So the yeah. podcast is just that. It's real <clears throat> conversation about biblical parenting I'm just going to give you a little preview of a couple of the topics that we'll cover in the coming months. Uh, the ministry of the family is first up. That's going to be with Justin. Um, we've got our children's behavior, obedience, the teen years, um, children and technology, and how to co-disciple your child, among many more uh, that we hope to uh give some light to for us as parents. Ben, tell us a little bit about our desired outcome for the podcast, because this isn't about you and I getting famous or making anybody else famous, right? No, not not in the, the least. Yeah. Um, we This is one of those things where we want to uh, use this as an opportunity to come alongside parents to challenge them, um, to encourage them, as well as to equip them in, in some of these areas. Um, you know, it's each of these areas are hard. They're they're difficult, um, especially as our kids grow. Their personalities change. We have to meet them in a different way. Um, some of the things that you just read off, some some people that hear that go, "Man, I'm glad we don't deal with issues with technology in our home." Or mm. uh, while at the same time, there's somebody that's going, 
my gosh, that has been the one of the more divisive things in our home. And so we know that each one of these are going to sort of meet people differently based off when, uh, how old their kids are, um, what they're going through in that moment, what they uh, have upcoming. And uh, so we just want to be able to come alongside parents and demonstrates the wrong word um, because I need help in every one of these areas yes, more than anyone anyway. that's listening. Um, but we do want to be able to just pull from God's word and see what does scripture say about this yeah. and how can I be uh, a faithful parent, uh, the kind of, of parent that God has called me to be so I can lead my family well, mm. so that I can lead my kids, I can guide my kids that I can ultimately be the disciple maker in their life um, that that helps them uh, and not just overcome issues, but so we can be a family that worships God together the way that he desires. And, and so that... To a degree, is, is sort of our what we what we hope comes out of this. How, what are ways, and what are things that we can emphasize that helps us be faithful parents that God, the kind of parents that God has called us to be. Yes, and with that, um, we want to be your trusted source for all things parenting. Um, and we're going to drop a new podcast at the end of every month on the Sunday, right after church It's going to be on Amazon music. It's going to be on Apple music, Spotify, and on our church website. Um, in addition to that, in the links to each podcast, we're going to have some more helpful resources beyond because these podcasts are going to aim at about 20, maybe 30 minute mark. And we know that we're not going to exhaust that topic. And so we want to point all. you into uh, the direction where we have either learned from ourselves or other trusted people have pointed us towards. So they might be other podcasts. They might be articles. In addition to those things, uh, in the book nook, there's going to be a dedicated bookshelf just for parenting resource helps. Uh, and we are going to highlight one of those helps every single month for each podcast that goes along with that topic. Uh, and so I'm encouraged as a, as a parent that I can have a resource to go to that's trusted. And I hope that you will feel the same way uh, and look forward to connecting with you on these podcasts and in person as we worship and glorify our Lord and enjoy each other's company and the benefits of iron sharpening iron and our encouragement in the Lord. So good. thank you, Justin, for being here. Thanks for having um, me. We'll see you next time. <laughs>